elusive, agile, and tenacious. The European Pie Martin is one of the UK's rarest carnivals. Roughly the same size as a domestic cat, these opportunistic predators are part of the mustelid family, which also includes otters and badgers. They play an important role in woodland ecosystems, eating what is locally and seasonally abundant, with voles being their favourite prey. They can be found roaming the forests and scrubland from as far north as Scandinavia to as far south as the Mediterranean. A few years ago, I had the opportunity to set up camera traps in the Forest of Dean with permission from Forestry England and Gloucestershire Wildlife Trust to help monitor a recently reintroduced population. They are without a doubt the most arboreal members of the mustelid family. Their long, bushy tails help them balance when climbing, as well as providing them with extra insulation in the winter months when wrapped around them in their dens. Unlike squirrels and dormice, pine martins have flexible ankles in their hind feet, which enables them to turn their feet 180 degrees when climbing down a tree. Pine martins have a rich brown fur coat, which contrasts with their pale bibs on their throat and chest. These bibs are a bit like a pine martin fingerprint. Each one is a unique shape with a different pattern of spots and can be used by scientists to identify individual animals. When it comes to pine martin territories, a male pine martin could have a home range of up to 33 square kilometres, where a female might have a smaller territory of up to 11 square kilometres. Within that territory, a female pine martin will rear her kits, usually in litters of two to three, which are born between March and April each year. By the time the kits are six to eight months old, they'll be fully grown and hard to distinguish from adult martins. Watching pine martins can be tricky due to their typically nocturnal behaviour. But in some areas of Scotland, you can increase your chances by visiting highs with bait stations. Just don't forget to pack your binoculars.